In H.P. Lovecraft's The Dunwich Horror, the eerie landscape of rural New England becomes a stage for cosmic terror and the clash between ancient malevolence and modern rationality. Set in the secluded village of Dunwich, Massachusetts, the narrative unfolds with an atmosphere laden with dread and mystery. Central to the story is the Wadley family, notorious for their reclusive and sinister reputation. Old wizard Wadley, a sorcerer steeped in ancient lore, has a daughter named Lavinia, who bears an otherworldly child known as Wilbur Wadley. From birth, Wilbur exhibits unnatural growth and an insatiable thirst for occult knowledge, which he seeks from the forbidden Necronomicon, a tome of eldritch secrets. Lovecraft employs Wilbur's pursuit of the Necronomicon as a catalyst for the horror that unfolds in Dunwich. Through his studies, Wilbur aims to unleash beings of immense power and malevolence upon the world. The narrative tension escalates gradually as the townspeople of Dunwich, initially wary of the Waitleys, begin to realize the dire implications of Wilbur's ambitions. The horror in The Dunwich Horror is multifaceted, blending cosmic terror with elements of the supernatural and the psychological. Lovecraft's prose evokes a sense of foreboding through descriptions of the desolate Dunwich landscape, with its ancient hills, overgrown forests, and decaying architecture. This setting serves as a metaphorical battleground ere the forces of modernity and reason confront primordial forces beyond human comprehension. Lovecraft's portrayal of the Wadley family exemplifies his recurring theme of degeneration and atavism. The Waitleys, descended from a lineage of sorcerers and aligned with ancient cosmic entities, embody a regression into barbarism and primal instincts. Their isolation from mainstream society mirrors a broader fear of the unknown and the uncontrollable, epitomized by their sinister rituals and unholy alliances. At the heart of the narrative is the titular Dunwich horror itself an invisible entity born from the union of Lavinia Wadley and an otherworldly entity. This creature, kept hidden from the townspeople in the Wadley homestead, grows monstrously and threatens to break free from its confines. Lovecraft's depiction of the horror underscores its incomprehensibility in sheer malevolence, challenging human perception and defying conventional notions of reality. The townspeople of Dunwich serve as a contrast to the Waitleys, representing rationality and scientific inquiry. Dr. Armitage, a professor of languages at Miskatonic University, embodies the archetype of the learned skeptic who confronts the supernatural with empirical methods. His role in deciphering the arcane texts and predicting the horror's emergence highlights Lovecraft's exploration of the fragility of human knowledge in the face of cosmic forces. Thematically, the Dunwich Horror explores the limits of human understanding and the existential dread that arises from confronting the unknown. Lovecraft's cosmicism posits a universe indifferent to humanity's existence, where ancient entities and eldritch horrors lurk beyond the veil of perception. The story's denouement, culminating in a climactic showdown between the horror and Dr. Armitage, reinforces the insignificance of human agency against cosmic forces. In conclusion, the Dunwich Horror stands as a quintessential example of H. P. Lovecraft's mastery of cosmic horror and his ability to evoke a sense of existential unease through atmospheric prose and intricate world-building. Through the lens of Dunwich, Lovecraft paints a chilling portrait of a world where ancient evils lie dormant, waiting to be awakened by those who dare to seek forbidden knowledge. The story remains a testament to Lovecraft's enduring influence on the genre of horror literature, captivating readers with its blend of supernatural intrigue and philosophical contemplation.